Hey, what's happening guys? Are you still excited for the Aunt May spin-off film? Well, too bad it's not really happening. Sony Pictures finally responds to this crazy rumor, a rumor which made a huge buzz over the internet for the past couple of days. In case you're not aware about it, Dave Gonzalez over at Latino Review posted an article where he claimed that apparently Sony are working on the Aunt May spin-off film, something which made me laugh for a very very long time. Now according to comic book resources who contacted a source who works at Sony, the source told us quote, it's just a silly rumor, there's no validity whatsoever. Apparently that's the case and apparently we are not getting out May spin-off film, I mean really? I was so excited. Now here is the official confirmation from Sony, finally Sony opened their mouth and actually said something, said something officially and they debunked this rumor, which still leaves the crazy rumor called glass selling from badassdigest.com where an author claimed that Sony are working on the female spin-off film where all these Spider-Man female heroines will actually team up for one particular mission. This rumor is still there, it's not debunked, but I'm pretty sure it's just one of the many many rumors which aren't true. Now once again it proves what I've been saying pretty much the whole time, rumors are rumors and official news are official news. Whenever you will see a crazy article with a crazy title like Sony are working on the Uncle Ben as zombie spin-off film, just don't really believe it and take it with a grain of salt, because it's not official, it's just a rumors. Just don't get excited, neither don't get disappointed that Sony are working on something crazy as that, because it's not official. Now what does worry me is that actually a lot of people believe this rumor. If you keep reading the comments over the articles and YouTube videos, people indeed believe that Sony are actually working on the Aunt May spin film, which is frankly sad. There are clearly some people who were so disappointed by The Amazing Spider-Man 2 that they indeed believe that something crazy as Aunt May's spin-off film might be actually made by Sony, so Sony need to prove them otherwise. It means that Sony need to do something, need to release something as soon as possible, they really need to keep up with Marvel and DC. I mean, we live in a world where an announcement about the upcoming film is more exciting than the actual trailer or than the actual film. These days DC and both Marvel actually announce something like almost every day, there are some casting announcements, some news, some announcement of the future films and Sony needs to keep up with the race. Actually despite my support for Sony Spider-Man franchise my thoughts currently are you know, even though The Sinister Six is getting released only in 2016, it's still not an excuse for not releasing any news. I mean, check out Marvel. Marvel are announcing films which will be released years from now, and I mean years from now. So Sinister Six, the filming should start next year, I mean January, February, logically, for logical reason I believe that it is probably starting in January or February. So Sony, there are no excuses for your silence, we are waiting. I mean, you're not announcing Sinister Six and Venom spin off film and then just staying quiet for months. You have to provide some information. It's like a food for us. It's like a food for all the fans. I mean, I've, I've been reading comments. Apparently, some people are pretty sure that the Venom spin off film is cancelled. I mean, guys, it's not cancelled. The Venom spin off film is in the works. In September, October, uh, Ed Solomon started working on the script. We've been getting official news about it, so the script is in the works. Maybe it's already finished. The Venom movie isn't cancelled. Whenever you will see such comments, just tell them that the movie is in the works. But I don't judge people who believe that the films are cancelled, because Sony aren't releasing anything. I mean, don't we deserve some piece of news, like guys, fans who seen the film, who seen The Amazing Spider-Man 2 for 10 times? Don't we deserve at least something, right? Just give us something. Give us some casting announcement, give us some poster or some teaser poster or something, just say something, keep up with the race. I will wait for the Sinister Six news for years, but there are people who are generally excited for all the superhero films and if Sony will stay quiet, a lot of people will forget about Spider-Man completely. So we are waiting, we are eagerly waiting for something from Sony and hopefully some Sinister Six news will come out very shortly there. As for the author of the article, well, we shouldn't really judge the whole website Latino Review just because somebody was wrong or somebody created something which wasn't really true and he just came up with it from nowhere. A Latino Review, they are still a great website, many many articles were actually true, many articles were actually coming from the alleged sources, so let's not judge the whole website. It's 
just one guy and he said something which isn't true. Anyway, let me know what you guys think. Were you among the ones who actually believe that Aunt May spin-off is actually in the works or you, just like me, prefer to believe the official information? Thanks for watching. Check out the full article down below and I'm out for now.